All right, so and I've already had it running a little bit, but I'll fire it up real quick and show you what I'm talking about. I've checked for vacuum leaks at the EGR valve, throttle body, intake, uh, but it's only misfiring at idle. You rev it up a certain RPM, or when you put it in gear and you rev it up and hold the brake, you can tell when the misfire cuts out and when it comes back. Um, so new plugs, new wires, new coils, new ICM, new injectors, new vacuum hose, new PCB valve, new crank sensor, new knock sensor and the connector, temperature sensor. Um, yeah, there's really nothing left. I don't know what else it could be. I've checked all this stuff, sprayed it around here. It didn't do anything. Um, but you took it down the road and balls to the wall. And I mean, this car takes off hard. It's only sitting still at idle that it's cutting up. Um, I'm still suspecting EGR valve, but when you push it in, like I did on my other Celebrity, this one doesn't stall. The other Celebrity would. So I'm wondering if it is sucking air, but I'm not getting anything to happen when I spray it with brake, uh, brake cleaner. But I'll fire it up and show you what I'm talking about. It's got some serious pressure for it to blow it out that far. Smells a little rich, just a little, but smells kind of normal. So it's got a built cam in it. motor shaking you rev it up and it goes away right back at idle cutting up again I, I don't get it And that temperature gauge is wrong too, I've noticed. It tells me that it's overheating, but it's not. Reverse, put on the gas. Watch this. See, this fire's gone. And then cutting up again. I just I don't get it it's driving me nuts because I don't know what else it could be unless it's a compression issue or something else but it runs so damn good